Today's video uncovers secret hacks to outsmart the airlines and find the best price on your next flight. The first hack for finding the best flight deals would be to look for codeshare flights and then book with the airline that is offering you the lowest ticket price. Airlines often share the same flight under codeshare agreements where one airline operates the flight but both will be selling the tickets. You can sometimes find cheaper tickets when you book through the partner airline's website rather than the operating airline's website. For example, when using Google Flights, you can identify a codeshare flight by noticing if there is more than one airline listed. I found a flight listed as operated by United Airlines, but is actually being flown by Air Canada as part of their partnership. Although the main link on Google Flights is directing me to the United website where the flight is going to cost $262, I scrolled down to find the direct link to book with the partner airline, in this case, Air Canada. A quick check on Air Canada's website showed me that the exact same flight is only $196. Both tickets are identical in basic economy on the exact same plane, but by booking on Air Canada's website instead of booking on United Airlines' website, I was able to save over $65. This example highlights why it's crucial to compare flight prices on both airline websites for codeshare flights, which tend to be especially common on international routes. When booking flights, whether international or domestic, always book on the website of an airline selling the flight rather than through a third-party site like Booking.com or Expedia. A flight from Newark to Venice can be found on Google Flights for as low as $471. Google Flights links you to British Airways' website where you can book this ticket to Venice for $552 and also gives you the option to go to American Airlines' website to book the same ticket for $480. It's a great idea to save money by booking with American Airlines, but it would be a bad idea to try to get the lowest price by booking with Kiwi.com. While these third-party websites like Kiwi.com might offer prices that are lower than the airline's website, the risk is going to outweigh the savings. If there's a flight disruption, such as a cancellation or a delay, you will need to contact the website that you booked with for support, and the airline customer service might not be able to help you with things like getting rebooked. Let us know down in the comments where you will be traveling next. And then also don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join us back here for more travel tips and hacks every week. The next hack is changing your virtual location to find the same flight ticket at a better price. When booking flights, the prices can vary based on where the website thinks you are located. I've partnered with NordVPN to show you how you can use their VPN to compare prices for the same flight from different locations to get the best deal. I'm currently in Canada, but with NordVPN, I can change my virtual location and appear to be looking for a flight from the US. Let's say we're eyeing a flight from Newark to Miami on January 15th, 2025. When I book through united.com while connected to a US server with NordVPN, it shows me prices as if I'm searching for this flight from the United States. Now watch this. I switch my location with NordVPN to Belize and the currency is still in US dollars, but you'll see that the prices change for the exact same flights. Here's what my dual monitor setup looks like. On the left, United.com thinks I'm in Belize searching for that flight from Newark to Miami, and on the right, it thinks I'm searching for that exact same flight, but doing it from the US. You'll notice that the prices from Belize are up to 20% higher for the same flights at the same times. So by simply changing your virtual location with a VPN, you can explore different prices for the exact same flights and potentially save money on your bookings. In a case like this, I'll save money by buying this flight ticket on the browser that's connected to the US, not Belize. You can get the best deal on NordVPN and try this hack out for yourself by checking the link down in the description or visiting nordvpn.com Megan. In addition to changing your virtual location, there are about a dozen other things that a VPN can do, such as keeping your online activities private. Not bad for less than $3 a month. One of the best strategies for securing cheap flights is to have the best deals delivered directly to you. Many services employ both human experts and automated systems to monitor flight prices around the clock. And it would be silly to not take advantage of their efforts, especially when notifications for top deals are free. Jack's Flight Club, Going, and Fairdrop are subscription-based services that help travelers find exceptionally low flight ticket prices. 
they send email alerts about cheap flight deals from your chosen departure airport. These services offer free subscriptions, which provide a limited number of deals, as well as paid membership options that feature more frequent alerts, as well as additional options like package deals, including hotels, with FareDrop. Airfare Watchdog is another great service that employs a team that manually searches and verifies the best flight deals, including special promotions and mistake fares. And for my fellow Canadians, websites like YYZ Deals will show you standout flight deals from Toronto. You can also use Yol Deals for flight offers from Montreal, and there are about a dozen other Canadian cities that you can find deals from. Jack's Cheap Flights also has options to send you deals from airports in Europe, the US, and Canada. Tracking flights yourself on Google Flights is another great way to get notified of flight price changes by email. You can set up alerts for your specific travel route and dates, so you can receive an alert for both price drops as well as price increases. It's smart to set a Google Flight alert on a particular flight route that you're considering but haven't booked yet. Being notified of a price increase as soon as it happens can help nudge you to book your ticket before the fare climbs even higher. I always kick off my flight searches on Google Flights and the standout feature is the Explore page. It's a fantastic tool that makes searching for flights both easy and fun. The real magic is seeing all the great deals that you can get from your home airport at a glance since you can set your departure airport and it's going to show you all possible destinations with the corresponding ticket price. You can keep the date range flexible with a one or two week trip anytime in the next six months or filter it by a specific month or even select specific dates that you know you will be available to travel. You can also apply filters like non-stop flights only so you aren't looking at cheap prices for flights with multiple connections that you would never actually take. There's also a filter for adding carry-on baggage so it's factored into the ticket price that you see upfront. This way, you won't be fooled by a low price only to find out that adding a carry-on suitcase is going to cost you an additional $60 each way. The fifth tip to find the best flight ticket price is knowing where to look beyond just Google Flights. I love Google Flights and I personally spend way too much time using their Explore feature, but there are other websites out there that are free to use and they do make finding flight deals even easier. AirWander finds stopover flights that let you explore a second city for little to no extra cost. Sometimes it's even cheaper than booking a non-stop direct flight. Skip Lagged reveals hidden city fares where you can save a ton of money by booking a flight with a connection, but then getting off in the layover city and not taking the remaining flights in the booked itinerary. Kayak's hacker fares combine one-way tickets from different airlines to lower the costs, and if you're looking at trying to figure out the best time to book a ticket, Hopper predicts when it's going to be the cheapest price with 95% accuracy. I also show you a website that is even more advanced than Google Flights and is a travel agent's secret weapon to finding the best deals. I dive deep into all of these websites and a bunch of others while teaching you exactly how to use them effectively in another video. I'll put it on the screen now and link it in the description for you to watch next. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join us back here for more travel tips and hacks each week and I'll see you in that next video soon. Bye!